Potassium superoxide is the inorganic compound with the formula KO2. It is a yellow paramagnetic solid that decomposes in moist air. It is a rare example of a stable salt of the superoxide anion. Potassium superoxide is used as a CO2 scrubber, H2O dehumidifier and O2 generator in rebreathers, spacecraft, submarines and spacesuit life support systems. Production and reactions Potassium superoxide is produced by burning molten potassium in an atmosphere of oxygen. K plus O2 KO2 The salt consists of K plus and O minus 2 ions, linked by ionic bonding. The O minus O distance is 1.28 A. Reactivity Hydrolysis gives oxygen gas, hydrogen peroxide and potassium hydroxide. 2KO2 plus 2H2O2 Co plus H2O2 plus O2 Potassium hydroxide Co absorbing carbon dioxide produces carbonates 2CO plus CO2 K2CO3 plus H2O Co plus CO2 KHCO3 Combining these two reactions produces 4KO2 plus 2CO2 2K2CO3 plus 3O2 4KO2 plus 4CO2 plus 2H2O4 KHCO3 plus 3O2 Potassium superoxide finds only niche uses as a laboratory reagent. Because it reacts with water, KO2 is often studied in organic solvents. Since the salt is poorly soluble in nonpolar solvents, crown ethers are typically used. The tetraethylammonium salt is also known. Representative reactions of these salts involve using superoxide as a nucleophile, e.g., in conversing alkyl bromides to alcohols and acyl chlorides to diacyl peroxides. Applications The Russian Space Agency has had success using potassium superoxide in chemical oxygen generators for its spacesuits and Soyuz spacecraft. KO2 has also been used in canisters for rebreathers for fire fighting and mine rescue work, but had limited use in scuba rebreathers because of its dangerously explosive reaction with water. The Russian IDA 71 rebreather was designed to be used with potassium hydroxide. The theoretical capacity of KO2 is absorbing 0.618 kg CO2 per kg of absorbent while generating 0.450 kg O2 per kg of absorbent. For 1 KO2 unit, it absorbs 1 CO2 molecule but only releases 0.75 oxygen molecules. The human body will produce fewer CO2 molecules than oxygen molecules needed because oxidation of food also needs oxygen to produce water and urea. Hazards Potassium superoxide is a potent oxidizer, and can produce explosive reactions when combined with a variety of substances, including water, acids, organics, or powdered graphite. Even dry superoxide can produce an impact-sensitive explosive compound when combined with organic oils such as kerosene. In 1999 at Oak Ridge National Laboratory, cleanup of potassium oxides from a NAC metal leak produced an impact-sensitive explosion while saturated with mineral oil. References